Hello, 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 everybody. This is Tina. Welcome back to my channel. Um, today is the House Mouse Collaboration for the month of June. Um, I'm so excited to share with you the cards that I made, and I'm so excited to go watch all the other ladies in the collaboration and see what they created as well. Um, I really appreciate you coming back each month, third Saturday of the month, uh, 3 o'clock Eastern Time, 12 o'clock Pacific time and um, I'm so happy that you're here and uh, so let's get started um, So I'm going to just share with you the some of the things that I used and then I'll share the cards Okay, so first of all the stamps that I used this month was this one here And I'm not sure uh, Which mouse this is? Sleeping with strawberries. This is mud pie 1986 yeah, I think it came out 1986 Mud Pie Sleeping with Strawberries. That's what it is. So I use that one. Um, I use this. I always thank God for you. That's a sentiment that I put in one of the insides. So I use that. Um, this house mouse stamp I used. And uh, like I said, I, I don't know what the names are. I take them out and put them in my binder. So this one here, it looks like they're he's diving for jelly beans, or it could be peanuts. Um, and then he, here's this little guy pushing on here, and this one's getting ready to jump in over here. So super cute. So I use this stamp. I use this one with the hummingbirds, which I absolutely love. So the mice are taking a ride on the hummingbirds, and the birds have these little flowers. It's so cute. So I use that. And I also use this one here where this little mouse is putting the suntan lotion on, on this one. There's a beach ball. Um, and then he has the lotion bottle. And look at his little feet sticking out from the sand. So cute. Oh, my gosh. Okay. Um, I use some Distress Oxide in Tumble Glass. I used a stencil from MFT. This is the small uh, cloud dye stencil. Um, I use this, uh, <coughs> excuse me, I use this Bow Bunny quotation stamps, and I think I used here, um, there are hundreds of languages, but a smile speaks them all. I think that's what I used in my card. <clears throat> so, I'll use that. I use this one here, which is Stamp Pendis, and I'm not sure what stamp in here I used, but I did use one of these sentiments. I use the CC Design Summer Sentiments. I use, of course, my Gina Marie Stitched Rectangle Die. Um, for papers, I use the uh, Glitter Stack. Um, I got this from Tuesday morning. I use this Bow Bunny Butterfly Kisses. I use this one for the Hummingbird card because there's hummingbirds in the paper. It's so beautiful. I love this paper. So I use that one. And then I also use this uh, Craftsmith um, Summer Pad Hot Buy Paper. And I got this from Michaels a long time ago. I don't remember when. But um, yeah, I use this paper pad as well. So that's what it looks like. Okay? So those were all the things that I used to create my cards. And I'm just going to move this out of the way. Okay, and then I'm going to share with you my cards. So the first card that I did was this one here. Isn't it adorable? Oh my gosh, I just love that little mouse. And he is all full from eating strawberries. Um, so I did some layering. This is the, um, <coughs> the summer paper pad I showed you. Um, this paper was in it, and it has little strawberries all around it. Then I used a white uh, cross-stitch layer. Uh, matte here then I did a pink one and then this is another white one that I stamped and colored with Copics on it um, I did the strawberries with the Copics and then after I was done I took a little black um, This pen that I got these were from the Enchanted Forest uh, collection from uh, Tuesday morning I, there was a four pack and I used this black pen to go in and put the little black dots on the strawberries and then over here, I use the Martha Stewart Punch on this glitter paper. Hopefully you can see that. Can you see that glitter paper right there? So there's a strip of glitter paper here with the edge punch on it. I did uh, this 
um, American Crafts ribbon. It's red with polka dots, white polka dots. And then this little strawberry button is from Joann's. I buy the, um, the dress it up buttons and this was in one of the packages and I thought it was perfect because it is a strawberry. So I did that. So that's the first card, you guys. And then here's the inside. And this is the where I used uh, You Make My Heart Smile. Um, that's the sentiment I used from um, that stamp pen to set when I said I couldn't remember which one I used. I just used that. You Make My Heart Smile and the little heart. And there's some more glitter paper. It's just a super cute card. And then the envelope, I just basically uh, stamped the image again. Uh, it's not colored in. So that's the first one. Um, the second card that I did was this one here. Um, and here they are jumping, going inside the jar for the pe I made them peanuts um, instead of jelly beans because jelly beans are more like Easter or spring. Um, we're into summer. So I just basically did the regular peanuts. And we have the two uh, brown mice um, and then this little gray mouse over here. And I'm not really sure which mice are which, but... Um, yeah, I just thought I would off do that, you know, that one a gray. And then I put glossy accents over the jar to make it look like it's real. Can you see the, there, can you see that? Um, okay, so the layers, I did this really nice peach. And then I did an off peach, like a, another layer here. And then this uh, flower paper was from that uh, butterfly, what was it called? Bow Bunny Butterfly Kisses. And then I did a little piece of wood grain paper here, the white layer that the image is on. And then I put this uh, little tiny satin uh, bow. I had the ribbon and I just tied it and um, stuck it there. It's so cute. Absolutely love it. I love the light colors. It's just so cute. And then here's the inside. Basically, I layered it the same way. The darker peach, the lighter peach, the flower paper, the uh, wood grain and then here's your spot to write and then this is that um sentiment that I told you I read to you it says there are hundreds of languages but a smile speaks them all so that one went in there so that is my second card oh my god you guys I am so excited I can't wait for you to see um this next card can you see those I want to leave them so you can see them oh my gosh this card oh I love this card so much. Okay, this is the one with the hummingbirds. Look at that. Isn't that so pretty? Oh my gosh. I did the hummingbirds with the light green, dark green, and then the blue. So I did them really, really, um, they really look like hummingbirds. And then I did the flowers purple, a very, very light purple. The little mice are flying on the hummingbirds. And then here are uh, green and purple that would match the birds and, and the flowers. Little tiny CC Designs enamel dots. They're shaped as hearts. And so this paper, um, I did the pink background, pink here, a white layer. And then this is the paper that has the hummingbirds on it from um, the Bow Bunny collection. And then the back of it has this blue paper here and I just did a little strip here um, going up behind these two mats so then this mat is white so we have pink white pattern white and then the top layer where the image is I did a light blue all around so it kind of uh, looks like the sky like they're up in the air and they're flying and then oh my gosh I just absolutely love this card it's came out so nice and I was very very happy with it and then here's the inside and so this is where I use that. I always thank God for you. And then um, the, I did layers in here. The pink, the white, the flowers, the other blue teal one that was um, on the back side of that one. Um, and then you have lots of room to write or you could write your message up here. Oh my gosh, I don't think I can ever part with this card. <laughs> I love it so much. I'm going to just probably hang on to it for a while before I gift it out to someone else. All right, so there are those. I got one more card for you guys. Um, I'm so happy that I was able to do four cards this month. Um, if you watched last month um, collaboration, you would have seen that I forgot. I thought it was the following weekend, and I was only able to get one card made. So I had to make it up to you guys, and this time I did four cards, and I'm so happy that I had the time to do these and um, get them out. So, all right, you guys. So, because it's summertime, this is my 
fourth and final card. So adorable. So we have this little mouse in the sand, his little feet sticking out. And then um, this one here is putting the lotion on him, I, the, the little white lotion, the beach ball. And then I did the sand with um, little dots. I did like two different tone browns and the lighter tan, I mean the lighter beige in there. So to make it really look like sand. This is where I used the cloud dye uh, stencil and I put made clouds all behind the behind them. And then I had these little dressed it up buttons and here's a little crab and this is a seagull. And then I layered this one with um, this ombre um, colored paper in the background. It has like yellows and it fades into like a peachy orangey color. Can you see that? It's really pretty. And then I used the orange uh, glitter paper. And the orange glitter paper matches the uh, sunblock tube. And then I did some white uh, gel pen on top of the cream to make it pop out more. I just love it. So cute. These little house mouse, they just... Oh, they're so adorable. So here I did the inside with the same layers paper. This is that ombre paper. This is a stitched rectangle. And then there's the sentiment. And then here's the glitter, the orange glitter. And the sentiment on this one is have a bright, sunny, sun shining day. Perfect for a summer card. So that is it, you guys. That are That is <laughs> my four cards for this month, June's house mouse collaboration um uh, remember it's always the third saturday of every month and it is uh, a year-long collab um yeah so if you want to watch any of the past videos that had um that i've done all the way up till this point till june i have a playlist um under on my channel so you can go to the playlist and you can watch all the house mouse videos if you would like um, don't forget to hop along to all the players that are down below in the description box. Please join their, go to their channels and see what they've created this month. And have a blessed Saturday. Have a great weekend. And we'll see you next time. Bye, everybody.